It's the E-Commerce Minute, your daily dose of e-commerce, tech, and retail news with your hosts, Bart Moraz and John Suter. The E-Commerce Minute is a production of Sumo Heavy, a digital commerce consulting firm in Brooklyn, New York, and Philadelphia. Find us on the web at sumoheavy.com. It's the E-Commerce Minute, episode 230. In today's episode, Uber to test five-minute drone food deliveries. Uh, it's been a while since we've done a good drone delivery story. We've all seen the stories of the food drone stunts across the world. Remember the stories we did on the Iceland sushi drone or the fried chicken drone in Fukushima, Japan? But how many of these drone delivery tests have come to fruition? I'm going to say zero. Well, Uber is giving it a go. Under the Uber Eats umbrella, Uber promises food delivery in 5 to 30 minutes, beginning in their test city, San Diego. The test is part of a new initiative from the U.S. Department of Transportation to begin testing the viability of commercial drones to deliver things like food, goods, and medical equipment. The wide-reaching program is called the Integration Pilot Program and chose a handful of states and companies to begin work on commercial drone testing. Some of the companies included in the trial are Uber, Amazon, Alphabet, Intel, FedEx, and Qualcomm, and a bunch of others that I don't feel like listing. Uber just can't be about cars, said Uber CEO Dara Kashraushi at the Uber Elevate Summit. That's their flying car summit held earlier in May this year. It has to be about mobility. It's my personal belief that a key to solving urban mobility is flying burgers in any city. We need flying burgers. <laughs> I am making a shirt that's going to say that. <laughs> we, need we need flying, flying burgers. burgers. So I picked this because today's Memorial Day and I'm sure everyone is having flying burgers today. <laughs> uh, actually, I would say it'd be amazing at the beach, right? Oh, yeah. You order, you order from a restaurant down the, down the street and then just delivers to you, you know, point point it to that just drops on you yep they don't get into the actual specifics and i'm sure it's the same thing that we've said before um now they say five minutes the five minutes means the food will get there but uh, i could go up to 30 minutes because some human has to be involved in you know between drone and person i think wait they can't drop the burger and can't drop a mouth flying burger (laughs) into my my mouth i don't i don't want to just just push it into my mouth while i'm just laying <laughs> the image of that is just brilliant I'm gonna say it again. we need flying burgers i don't know i don't know if we need flying but it's just like the the tip of ice over laziness uh Sad. yeah well i mean that's why uber eats growth has been pretty explosive in the last two and a half years because people like to push a button and get food that's yeah, I mean, I don't, I see that. I mean, it's going to be just interesting. <laughs> and then you have burgers. What What about if they don't hold on, on together and you have like flying burgers all over the place? And people? <laughs> Is that like or a they, shake? They, they still wrap the burgers. They don't just stick it on top of the, you know, like a just <laughs> stick it right on top of the jar and balance it and send your burger out. <laughs> I just I want a burger, fries, and some and some shakes. And I just need to know: shake. is there a separate is there is there a separate condiment drone? Okay. <laughs> Excuse me, you forgot my hot sauce. Uh, oh God! Imagine these things flying all over the place. Uh, so, yeah, I mean Uber is again. They they had this. They had a whole summit on flying cars. So I think that's where they want to be. They want to be first in the air with the flying cars. I know they were doing already doing stuff in Saudi Arabia or Qatar or, or um, somewhere in the Middle East where they seem to be so far ahead of us and all that kind of stuff. And I think a lot of that is a regulation and b their infrastructure is newer. So you can do stuff that flies because there's place for the there's places for the stuff that flies to land. <laughs> <laughs> there's places to fly and places. Yes, there's places to fly and places to land. Said flying things. Ah, uh, yes. Pretty interesting. That is true. All well, right. I hope people will enjoy their Memorial Day weekend. Yes, it's. Uh, uh, get back happy, to work tomorrow. Happy Memorial Day. Get back to work. You're probably not even listening to this on Memorial Day, so we could probably just say anything today and no one would care, right? Yeah, I know. Maybe they'll listen. I think everyone cares. On the everyone beach. Cares. Laying on the beach uh, <laughs> with their margarita. Um, enjoying our podcast. Be fantastic. With a flying burger. <laughs> <laughs> All right. That's it. All right. Anything else? That's it. That's your e-commerce minute for today. Happy Memorial Day. We'll see you on the internet and back to work tomorrow. That's it for today's show. If you like the show, do us a favor and subscribe, or leave us a review on iTunes. 
And don't forget, you can now listen to the e-commerce minute on your Amazon device. Just add e-commerce minute to your flash briefing. And finally, if you have a comment or suggestion, or just want to say hi, find us on social media at Sumo Heavy. The podcast you just heard was recorded with Anchor. If you want to make your own, download the Android or iOS app completely free from anchor.fm slash podcast. That's anchor.fm slash podcast.